Well, guys, I gotta see Otter. Heart is a ghost town. What's up, guys? Welcome back to the vlog. Today, we are starting things out at, well, almost at, at home. We're starting things out with the second day of camping here in the cabin. And we're about to make some breakfast and hang out for a little bit. We are taking off now to see what we can find to do around the campsites. Probably just go out to the nearest city and see if they got anything there. Guys, check out this dam. It's huge. It's huge. going and taking a tour of the dam and I totally just tripped over that sidewalk good job anyway we're gonna be taking a tour of Grand Coulee I almost called it McNary please don't interfere with the shot my dude anyway I'll see you guys once we're in the toy Okay. All right, we're on the bus right now, heading on down. Let's do this. Trails for sand, rock, and gravel, or the aggregate in our concrete. As we get up around this corner here, I'll have everyone look off to your right and have everyone guess what they did with all the leftovers. So a pump generator different from a pump in so much as it can reverse flow and actually function as a generator in addition to a water pump. They are all capable of pumping a billion gallons a day. One megawatt can power between six to seven hundred homes. Almost two thirds of all our power comes from that third powerhouse. You'll notice when we get out there's large sloping concrete tubes that go into the backs of the building. Those are the penstock tubes. That's what the water goes through to power the generators. Those are 40 foot in diameter. Really Guys, look how far down that is. Anybody got a penny? That's absolutely really far down. That looks like you could kill a person if they jumped. Guys, this is what the outside of the dam looks like that we were just at. It's pretty big. What they say, like almost a mile long? Yep. So we just wrapped up the Grand Coulee Dam tour, and we hung out down at the visiting center for a little bit. Ended up getting a little sea otter thing. And uh, we're gonna be going and getting lunch right now, and then seeing if we can find anything else to do. Well guys, I got a sea otter. Here he is, his name's Roger. We're swinging by here to pick up some ice cream. Well, I, I was told that there'd be a milkshake, like milkshakes here, so I'm gonna get one of those. 27 different flavors. I ended up getting a Death by Chocolate milkshake, so I'm just waiting for, on that to come on out. I also got this coin from Grand Coulee as well, so that's pretty cool. All right, I got my drink. It's not running me. It's good. <clears throat> there we go. It's actually really good. I completely destroyed that, you guys. We are on our way back now. Heading to the car so we can get back to the campsite and make some lunch. Um, what do we even have? Sandwiches? Oh, hey. Hey. Did you get everything? All right. Yes. Anyway, we're heading back there to make us some lunch. You guys, we're really close to hitting that 1,600 subscriber mark. Just a reminder that when I do hit it, I will be doing a giveaway of a $20 iTunes gift card. Play $20 game, gaming gift card from 
Google Play. So if you guys want to be a part of that, all you have to do is smack the subscribe button and just share the channel with your friends. You guys, I'm vlogging from my phone right now because my camera is about to die, so I left it back at the cabin site. But right now, we are waiting for the light show to start. Nothing really happened between the last clip you saw and now. Basically, we just hung out at the cabin. But we are just waiting for the laser show, not light show, laser show to start down at the Grand Coulee Dam. You guys are going to be seeing some of that as well. <laughs> Coyote was communicating with the Great Spirit that one day, the Great Spirit said, there's going to be two legs walking among you. So you're going to have to find out how you can take care of them. All we have in this river is just water. They would come to Soap Lake once in a while where they had uh, Saturday night dances. I went with a girl over there for three years. The job was good for me, really good to me. All in all, it was a good experience. And they were getting rid of everything along the shore, all the way up from Cooley Dam, clear up to Little Falls. Which needed moisture to Washington farmland, averaging just 6 to 10 inches of rain per year. Progress on the Columbia Basin Project, the 1935 plan to irrigate huge swaths of the inland northwest, resumes. Well, you guys, that is going to wrap it up for the video. I am back in the cabin now. But anyway, like I said, it's going to wrap up the video. If you guys did enjoy it, then please smack that like button. If this is the first time you've seen one of my videos, then do consider subscribing to join the Biz Army today. Don't forget to turn on my post notifications so you never miss a new video. Shout out to the video goes to Callie G. I'll put a link to one of her music videos down below. But apart from that, I'll see you guys next time.